This is uh, Barbecue Bubba. It's mid-June. Just uh, got back into town and uh, going to be doing a pork butt. Seven pounds. And I'm going to walk you through the steps on doing a simple pork butt. 225 temperature till 160 internal. And then I'm going to go ahead and uh, wrap it in foil. Put some apple juice on it. And uh, I'll explain a little bit later as we go. So for this uh, pork butt, I'm going to go ahead and do it on my junior. Going to walk out, turn it on, hit it to smoke. I'm gonna go ahead and lift the cover up, wait till it starts smoking, and then I'll turn the temperature to 225. Not sure how many hoppers, a little less than half full, so I'm gonna go ahead and top that off and uh, season that pork butt up and put it on here. All right, so my grills are, pellets are lit. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it to 225. I topped off my hopper. I'm gonna show you at the end of the cook how very little the junior uses. So uh, turn it to 225. Gonna go ahead and shut the lid, go inside, and uh, season up the thing and beat it. The thing. I'm gonna go ahead and go inside and season up the pork butt and be out here in a few minutes. All right, for the pork butt, seven pounds, I went ahead and seasoned it up. Got some Jacobson salt, some uh, pork rub, butt rub that I got, I think I got from Costco. And then, of course, the uh, Traeger, sorry about the camera work there, pork and poultry. So I got it all seasoned up. Grill's heating up to 225. Even do the cavities down below. Get it all in there, pat it down. If I had time, I'd let it sit for an hour just with the seasoning on it. But uh, just kind of did this on the spur of the moment. So uh, hope this helps out. Okay, so I got my seven pound pork butt on there. I've got a mini probe on that I'm going to run through there. It's a Bluetooth that lets me allow to, to uh, watch from the inside of my house. I'm in Arizona, so I don't want to come out here and push a knob and check the temperature. The new Traeger uh, Juniors have a probe here. Mine doesn't. Mine's 2017 April I bought it. So uh, got it at 225. We're sitting at about 220 right now. I'm going to go. It's 1115 and I'm going to go ahead and shut the lid and we'll uh, keep you updated. All right so I've taken it off. I'm going to put it in this and then I got to uh, I didn't have any regular apple juice. I had some cranberry apple, so I put some cranberry apple in there. I'm gonna foil it with probe in it, and I'm gonna take it off around 205 internal temperature. And I'm gonna put it in a cooler and let it sit for about two hours. Back to the pork butt, just put it on, foil it, put the probe back in. And you can see almost five hours of smoking. I barely use but maybe two pounds, two and a half, three pounds of wood. So it's been seven hours with the pork butt on, and I've had an internal temperature of about 198, and that's how many pellets I've gone through in seven hours, probably, I'm guessing five pounds in seven hours. So I bumped it up to uh, 275 just to keep the heat up a little bit faster the last uh, five, six degrees. Want to hit an internal temperature of about 205 before I pull it off. Okay, it's been seven and a half hours. I got a temperature of 205 internal. I'm gonna go ahead and pull out the meat probe, turn it down to uh, shut down cycle. Go ahead, I wanna show you how many pellets I use for seven and a half hours. This is an eight pound hopper, and that's what I use. It was completely full with eight pounds. I probably got about, I don't know, two, three pounds left. So roughly five pounds, maybe six pounds, who knows. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and take this pork butt off. I'm going to bring it over here. I'm just going to set it inside this cooler. This is the most important part, is just taking an old towel and just setting it over here and just tightening it up and then shutting the lid. Leave it for about two hours. Pull it off, pull it apart. Unbelievable. We'll be eating a little bit late tonight, but uh, this is a last minute pork butt, but uh, the results are always good. See you in a little bit when we pull it apart. Okay. Okay, it's been about two hours. I'm gonna go ahead and pull this uh, towel out, put it over here. I'm gonna bring the cold pork, oh, bring the cold pork up and set it up here, pull the foil off, and you'll see the yummy cold pork. And then uh, get yourself a these bear claws, these are really good. But you'll see this just falling apart. Look at that. Look at that smoke ring. Pulled pork, look at that. It's so awesome. 
And while this was resting in the cooler, go ahead and go over here, I uh, had some uh, au gratin potatoes and I went ahead and threw those on the Traeger. Just follow the directions on the back here. I think it was 450 for 25 minutes. So I put it on the Junior and made a side dish of au gratin potatoes. So uh, that's what we're having for dinner. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video and Barbecue Bubba signing out.